Congressman Jordan, why would repealing Obamacare be better for women than keeping it in? Well, like I said, uh, I start from the, the, the premise that health care will be better and less expensive when Obamacare is repealed. And we know that the, you know, the vast majority of the American people understand that Obamacare has been a failure because they know everything they were told turned out to be false. They were told if you like your plan, you can keep your plan. They were told if you like your doctor, you can keep your doctor. They were told that premiums would go down. They were told premiums would go down on average $2,500. They were told deductibles would go down. They were told that the website was going to work when it was first introduced. Obviously, it didn't. They were told the website was secure. It wasn't. Um, they were told that um, the co-ops, which were formed just two years ago, two and a half years ago, uh, 23 co-ops, 18 of them have already went bankrupt costing the taxpayers a lot of money. And those people who were in the co-ops no longer have that, that option. So uh, everything they were told turned out to be false. And we know they were told false statements because Jonathan Gruber, the quote, architect of Obamacare, uh, was caught confirming this very fact that they misled the American people. Um, so I start from that perspective that when you get rid of Obamacare, healthcare will be better. And I believe when you put in the right kind of market-oriented um, uh, principles and models, you will, uh, you will have less expensive health care.